Okay, it looks like we have a sports card coming up. <laughs> what up, Rap Pack? It's your boy here, King Rap Jar, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys already know the drill, Nickelodeon Splat Flip is <laughs> about to get a whole lot brighter, Rap Pack, because your boy is here. Welcome to ADHD's life. If you hear a squeaking sound, it's because of a particular animal named Daisy. <laughs> you stop! Just stop with the- stop with the- I never know where it went. <laughs> Alright, as I was saying, today what we're going to be doing is on the table right now, I have some exclusive trading cards that I have been hunting for for literally MONTHS! You know how long months are, Parker? Collection of 30 days or 31 days? That would be a month. I said MONTHS. That's why I said a collection of them. Oh. Well then I guess you got the right definition. Okay! <laughs> So months! I have been looking for this product ever since the first ever Spongebob Aquatic Amigos and working on this binder right here guys. If you guys are new here, this channel and the attempt is to make the ultimate Spongebob binder. We have nearly the complete Aquatic Amigos, nearly the complete top, so the few cards are missing. We're working on it, slowly but surely it will happen. And then, including the arcade cards, but there is something more that has not been discovered. So, what I have right here guys is a, a product that was made for the rep pack. It was made for this channel where nostalgia happens I found a trade no 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 not yet I found a trading card game that includes all Nicktoons yeah so I'm talking fairly odd parents I'm talking Jimmy Neutron damn he's got a big ass head and hopefully his other head is because he's grown up to be as big <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking rocket power all types of freaking shows from Nickelodeon and it is made by Upper Deck see his deck upper deck with the deck on top <laughs> It is made by Upper Deck, and here they are. These things, guys, are one of those products where it's like, it can go for like $30 if somebody lists it for that price, or it can go for like $500 because nobody sees it in like five months. I spent quite an, un an unfortunate amount. Very unfortunate amount. But, anyway, the point is, it doesn't matter. The money could, be come, could come back somehow, hopefully. But, what matters is right here. The Nicktoons trading card game. Brand new seal. Both boxes, guys, are right here being busted open for the first time I've ever seen on any notable notable level on YouTube. Here we go. Let's do it. Okay, so this is going to be a part of the SpongeBob slash Nickelodeon now binder. So we're going to be doing it from the back right here and trying to complete the Nicktoon set. The chase cards we are going for in this video rep pack is first off, the most important thing for me. I want to complete what they have in here is a fairly odd parent set that has 30, 30 motion cards. This basically means when you move them side to side, they play a little scene of of the show, which is absolutely awesome because Fairly Odd Parents is one of the most iconic shows on Nickelodeon, in my opinion, debatably only topped by SpongeBob. So, I would, have, would love to add anything Fairly Odd Parents to the collection, so I want to get that set. But, in SpongeBob relation, to add to this epic SpongeBob binder here, there is 10 limited art cards of SpongeBob SquarePants characters doing sports activities. I'm talking football, baseball, soccer, anything you think of. And it is limited artwork only in this set. Dang, that's like, that's like Nickelodeon freaking uh, do perfect. Yeah, do you guys see SpongeBob dunking with that, like, like Jordan with his tongue out? <laughs> so let's pop this thing open and oh dude those are so freaking fresh oh my god if i ever imagined what a nicktoons pack would look like that's it <laughs> yeah it's really inclusive so we're gonna open this first pack let's see every pack has a motion card so hopefully we should be able to complete that setup for sure let's get into it all right so here we go first time ever opening a nicktoons pack let's do it oh my god dude those are so clean i was worried they're gonna be low quality but dude these are Nice. Is that maybe like a explanation card or? I think this is something where you can submit and get your own Nicktoon card made. Oh, dude. <laughs> what are you still up? Um, it's not up. We can make our own. Like seductive or cute? You um, look a little weird. I don't lie. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. All right, so this is the back of the card. We're gonna flip it over and see what the first card is. Okay, right here, Ooh. Adventure's Gone Wrong, and we have the Krusty Krab. Come spend your money here. And the next card, Oh, oh. <laughs> Mr. Crocker. Do you ever notice Mr. Crocker's ear is on his neck? Yeah. Butch Hartman is amazing, but I don't know why he always puts Mr. Crocker's ear on his neck. The next, we got Guess Who. Oh my God, that is sick. So these are Guess Who questions where they'll ask you a question, a Nickelodeon trivia question, and we're gonna try and get it. So I'm gonna be trying to see how close I can get on these answers. See if I can try and get every single one right. You guys play along at home and see if you guys can get them right too. One's a mother, one's a fairy godmother. One fixed cars, one fixes magical misshapes. Mishaps. 
I'll miss that song because it's sheeps. <laughs> Who are they? Do you well, know? I mean, there's, I mean, the one that's obviously Wanda. Yeah, one's Wanda. So what show has a mother? There's Jimmy Neutron. There's fairly odd parents. They all got mamas. <laughs> yeah, they have, oh, they but one moms. fixes cars. Do you remember the episode where Jimmy Neutron's mom rolls underneath the car? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I do remember that. It has to be her. All right, so I think it's Judy Neutron, also Wanda, from Fairly Odd Parents. Let's see what the answer is. Hey! <laughs> I love these so much. That is awesome. So behind that, we got the... <laughs> and next, we got... Hey, dude! No. Oh my god! So right here we have the motion card. This is insane, dude. The quality on this thing. The card behind it is the one we already saw. That is a solid card. Like, it's like vinyl almost. The time travel bike? The time traveling scooter? I, I feel like I remember this episode. That oh had, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's them in the in the future, right? No, this is them now. And this is Cosmo and Wanda at Woodstock. Oh, but <laughs> All right, next pack, here we go. I am already in love with this set. So let's see what we got here. We flip it, and oh, what is this? Yeah, dude, we got the first tap preview card. So this is an exclusive card. So this literally, this character would have not have had a visual. Because at the time, the internet wasn't really where it's at now. So it would have literally been your first look at this character. That is freaking insane. <laughs> All right, next card. Hey, right there. We got our first SpongeBob sports card. He's using a freaking jellyfish basket as the hoop. So this artwork, guys, is of Patrick, and you can only get this artwork in here. And oh, right, there's the Wanda. But this is definitely gonna go into that SpongeBob binder. It cannot be a part of the other set. It's a subset within this set, so that set is going into this set. All right, gotta be in the SpongeBob binder. We got Wanda right here. We got a <laughs> mermaid man. The next card. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> all right. So we got Timmy's mom doing her shig right here. Man, I cannot tell you guys how bad I want to complete this whole set. Oh, because that was our last card right there. Let's keep these going. I'm just going to start rocketing through them, guys. We are going to complete this entire Fairly Odd Parents set and the entire set as a whole. All right, so first card, let's see what we got here. Ooh, adventure gone wrong. That's when Timmy was inside of his own body, like defending off antibodies. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so right here we have adventure gone wrong. We got Gare Bear right there. We got Guess Who. Here we go. One's an extreme athlete who's totally zen at 10. And the other is a bitter invertebrate who spreads feelings of gloom wherever he goes. Can you name them? So one we can assure is Squidward. I'm going to say extreme athlete who's totally zen. Reggie Rocket. It's got to be Reggie Rocket. Or it could be maybe Squid. Let's see who it is. Right here. Three, two, one. Hey! Oh! Okay, so it's actually Otto. I didn't really think Otto would be the zen one because Otto is definitely more of the um, the more outgoing one. Reggie's definitely more a little bit more zen, but hey, I'm not Nickelodeon, so apparently I was wrong. So right here we got Otto Rocket and we got Squidward right. That was that was right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then right here we got Timmy's mom. After we just saw her dancing, man, I freaking Timmy's mom is set. And then we got a right there the clip where they're transforming, dude, into the dogs. Fairly Odd Parents, guys. I have to say, Fairly Odd Parents is one of my favorite shows of all time, and even I don't talk about it as much as credit it deserves. Butch Hartman is a freaking animation deity amazing great show and i can't complete the complete set all right next pack i am just i am sad for when these are over here we go oh, oh. we got do you know who charles hampton indigo is this is the alias for the Crimson Chin! Oh, that's right. <laughs> that would be an epic motion card. That would be, I would be in awe. Here we go, next one we got, oh, right here. You remember this scene. Oh, of More. course I do. <laughs> you know you wanted that jellyfish sauce on your goddamn burger. Oh, dude, I didn't want that regular. I wanted that shiny blue oh, jellyfish that blue, jelly. <laughs> that's, that looks so good. Hey, all you people. Hey, all you people, won't you listen to me? The set is dope. You're gonna love it. It's got these motion cards. They're so sick. <laughs> All right, so this is the next card. We got, hey, dude, we got rocket power. This kid right here. We got Prince of the Netherworld. This kid thought he was like some kind of prince, and well, you know, Otto and everybody else told him very much that he was not. Look at them freaking clown feet. We got, oh, oh AJ. <laughs> we got AJ. Look at them smug lips. Chester, you dumbass bitch. <laughs> All right, let's see what the next card is. We got, oh, motion card, motion card. What is it gonna be? Hey, the opening scene. Got them coming out of their fishbowl. The most iconic scene of every episode when the Fairly Odd Parents pop out of the fishbowl. Okay, here we go, next pack. We haven't seen a SpongeBob sports card in a while, which makes me a little sad, but it's okay. First card, Carl Weezer. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I actually got to be in a room with the voice actor, Rob Paulson, who actually voices Carl. I got to actually voice act with him. Hi, Marcus. I'm Carl. Hi. It's nice to meet you. My pleasure. Nice to meet you. Which was amazing. If you guys haven't seen that, it's on the Nickelodeon pages somewhere. Facebook. But Facebook. I don't have Facebook, but it's there. <laughs> I got Carl Weezer right there. And oh, there it is. <laughs> there it is. There's the blue jellyfish jelly. And then next. Ooh. Right there. Right there. We have two of the 10 SpongeBob sports cards. And the next. Yeah, dude, we got freaking Twister's brother, Lars. That was like, I I hated him. Like, he was like the biggest jerk. So there's Lars, and then we got, ooh, oh. right there. Do you see the zoink? Yep. <laughs> right here, we have Timmy returning on the freaking time scooter. And you can see that clear as hell. Fairly Odd Parents, zoink, come up. That is like classic Fairly Odd Parents. Butch Hartman amazingly does that. It's almost like a comic book. Gonna keep going through them. We'll do a binder update as we get through it. All right, next pack we're cracking into. All right, do the flip. Hey, we got Sandy right there. You can't beat a classic. Is she just doing well, I, karate? I think, yeah, I think that's a sports card. Okay, well. She'd be doing karate, yeah. Well, that one's a little underwhelming. I guess that counts. We got karate Sandy. All right, the next card. Ooh, right there. You are looking at the first appearance of Tack and the Power of Juju. I don't know who that is. I mean, maybe Seth Rogen and Jonah Hill, but mm, those are two Jujus. <laughs> next card. Ooh, adventure's gone wrong. This is the beauty pageant contest and on how to run for her money. <laughs> Next one, SpongeBob. Oh, oh it's just regular SpongeBob. Sick with his base set SpongeBob. Now we got the card. I'm gonna put the little side so we can see it right away. And, oh, oh. love concern. That is so sick. And if you guys remember this, this is from the actual episode the same way when they poop away. They're worried about Timmy and they poop away with love and concern. <laughs> All right, here we go, next pack. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and say it. What sport do you think Mr. Krabs is playing? I'm just gonna say weightlifting. I'm gonna say crab shoot. I think he is going to be playing football. What about beach volleyball? Wasn't he like really good at that in the episode? Not sure. I'm gonna go with football because he's armor Rabs crabs. All right, so right here we have Jet Fusion. Oh my God. <laughs> if you don't remember the premiere of Jimmy Neutron Jet Fusion, what were you doing in 2004? <laughs> All right, so we got Jet Fusion. We got the guest card. Okay, here we go. Uh, this fairly godfather usually messes up more things than he fixes. While his friendly manager makes sure the local skate rats have a place to call their own, who are they? I'm gonna say Cosmo. Oh, they're two different people. Oh my yeah. god. I was thinking like, how? How is it the same person? <laughs> I'm saying Cosmo. Okay, yeah, I yeah. agree. Then the next, a manager that local skate rats have a place to call their own. So it's a place, I'm thinking, Shack, Rocket Power. Manager so, would be so their Tito. dad. Or Tito, that's what I'm saying. I don't know who. I think you might be right because I think their dad might be the owner. Oh, we were oh. way off. Oh my God, just Conroy. Damn, that just makes sense. He's the guy that actually ran the skate park. I don't know why I didn't make that connection. I didn't think he was a big enough character to be a guess who, but I guess I'm gonna have to go deep depth for this. These things are actually pretty hard. All right, so after that, we got the next card. Oh yeah, I'm saying sports. Oh, oh. do you? Oh, it's, it's, it's flat. Oh, dude, we got flats right there. Not a sports card. And then the next card we got, oh. oh guess who that is just from that. We got Tootie right there. Hi, Timmy! <laughs> then right here we got, this has okay, to be, okay. oh my god, I see him working out and I already love it. <laughs> <laughs> that is when Timmy's dad went on his whole athletic binge and his mom just not in the best shape of her life that time. <laughs> oh. so we have another motion car right there. I really, really hope, so far we haven't gotten any duplicates. I'm just hoping, praying, we can finish this whole set of at least the Fairly Odd Parents cards before I have to get more packs. All right, next pack. Doing the flip? Oh, you remember Nick Dean. I remember Nick <laughs> Dean. And the next, okay, we got the adventure got wrong. So these are all different episodes. I'm starting to realize they're all episodes where something went tragically wrong along the way. And this is when they realized. Like this fucking <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> all right, so we got that one. I cannot tell you guys how much I love these cards. Next up we got, oh. Oh yeah, we got Poof's real daddy. We got Juan <laughs> Dissimo. <laughs> these two had a kid. I'm pretty sure, I don't know, I think he come out smelling like a freaking $500 cologne. I'm pretty sure that like, species would start to suffer from the lack of pretty everyone else is getting. <laughs> Okay, I'm a little scared now. Name the girl who defines girl power in Bikini Bottom Seashores. I'm gonna say Pearl. I'm gonna go ahead and guess Sandy, but I think there might be more than one character on here, so here we go. Oh, dude, also the freaking card. We're gonna see both at the same time. See the freaking motion card and see the answer. Here we go. Oh! No! <laughs> Oh 
my god, the answer is Sandy and Reggie, who cares? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so right here we have the scene where Jorgen Von Strangle had been over pumped with magic and he started to grow to a hulkish size. He looks freaking sick in that card, dude. Alright, that right there is my favorite oh, yeah. motion oh, card. Absolutely. Jorgen Von Strangle is like the reptar of Fairly Odd Parents. He is epic. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> bubble bath. You forgot the pickles. Oh, and we have Francis. Nice. All right, and the next we got. All oh, right, <laughs> we got George Washington from Fairly Odd Parents. I think this is with the wooden teeth. And the next we got a sports card. The sports card is SpongeBob SquarePants. Oh, he's shredding the nar. That is awesome. And the the motion card. Oh, we got Cosmo changing from meat to a dog. <laughs> that one's pretty simple. All right, next pack. So far, we've been doing good over here in No Dupe City. So keep it up. Okay, so we got right here. Adventures gone wrong. I'm not aware of that scene in particular, but pretty cool card. All right, next, we got. Oh, oh that is awesome. They put him with a magnifying glass. We got. I'm small. And then Patrick doing the ice skating, dude. Oh, dude. This is what I think it is. Oh, my. Chester? It's not Chester. No. This is when you find out this Chester's dad was the worst player for the Dimsdale baseball team. Oh! And I think they made his sports card into this card. No way. That would be sick. Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> We got Bucky McBad Bat. I, I, my knowledge on this part becomes a little bit blurry because I cannot remember if this is Chester's dad or if they just look similar. But I know for sure Bucky McBad Bat was the worst player in all of Dimsdale. That is so sick. And then the motion card. Oh yeah, we got the classic episode where Timmy's hamster gets swapped out with Cosmo. <laughs> All right, here we go, doing the flip. Oh, Goddard! We got the the bolt pooping dog, Goddard. And then the next card is oh, always floss your teeth before dinner, and it comes down on plaque. <laughs> and we got adventures gone wrong. Oh no! Oh no! Oh! oh. <laughs> All right, and the next one. Okay, guess who? What characters are friendly, faithful, and utterly unique pets to SpongeBob and Jimmy? Oh, Gary. And Goddard, right? Oh, another situation where we're gonna see the, the motion card as well. So let's flip at the same time. Boom! Okay, hey! Okay, so we got the answers right on that one. But we have the opening card right here where Vicky is yelling at Timmy's face. <laughs> Tell me if you guys remember that song. Hey, Vicky, all oh, so sticky. Just the thought of being around you makes me oh so sicky. Ew! <laughs> All right, that was iconic. You guys have to remember that. All right, guys, I said that there was gonna be two booster boxes open. I'm gonna try my best, but these cars, dude, these have been so lit. Yeah, it's this, like every card is a different thing. It's something epic, so I don't know how long the video could be. Let's get to the end of this box and we'll assess things and maybe, maybe by the end of the box, there's like so many duplicates will pop into the last one. But if like we get to the end of this box and we're still getting like every pack fresh cards, might have to save for another video just to save you guys from an hour long video. Let's do the flip. Boom. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's Pearl. There's the girl power. We got Pearl right there. Oh! Nice! <laughs> we got this one. Let's see the next one. Patrick Star. I like the artwork on him. It's a little interesting. Next we got... Oh! <laughs> Mark Chegg, who's also done by Rob Paulson. And then let's see what the Fairly Odd Parents motion card. We got Unicorn, Cosmo, and Wanda. That is freaking epic. Oh, we have Dad. <laughs> and then next is Sheed. Yes. The next card we got Gone Adventure. Okay, so this is Adventure Gone Wrong. This is when he meets Mark Chang. And then the next card we got Barnacle Man <laughs> right there. And then there got to be the, the motion card. So far, we haven't gotten a single duplicate on it. Let's see what happens. Three. Two, one. Oh, oh he yes. was getting that freaking Trixie, man. He getting that Trixie Tang. All right, sweet. Okay, guys, this is insane. There's been no duplicate. Oh my God. This is literally banger pools after banger pools. We got SpongeBob surfing. This is not a duplicate. We got an ever board variation. So snowboard, skateboard, surfboard. But boards, yeah. SpongeBob sports car, tack the power of Juju. I'm gonna try to go a little faster, guys. We got, oh, right there, the adventure gone wrong where Cosmo gets a cat dropped on him. The next we've got Chester. Come on, we need a crimson chin one. There's gotta be in here. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, that's sick. We got Cosmo evolved into the goldfish. That's very similar to the one we saw earlier. So I would have loved to have seen something else. At least it's different. Yeah, at least it's different. At least. All right, let's do the flip. 
Oh, dude. Wait a minute. Okay. So this is SpongeBob doing karate. And this is the sports card. You said that other one of Sandy doing that was also karate. So that, that probably goes in that spot. Oh, jellyfish. <laughs> oh, no, no, that's that's uh, Howard. <laughs> Howard. <laughs> the question card. Whether you're dealing with the mishaps of a friend's kooky fairy godparents or building a robot dog, these two brainiacs are up to the challenge of who they are. Okay, I'm... Jimmy Neutron and then AJ? Yeah, Jimmy Neutron, AJ, for sure. There is a dope card that's going to be behind this as well. Let's check that one out first. Boom! Oh, we got yeah. the man. Jorgen Von Strangle. <laughs> This is the answer. Boom. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And the next one we got. Oh! oh! Larry the Lobster. What is the motion card? Oh, dude. Oh! We have it right here. He's doing the uh, video game. He like heading to his breakfast, too. Yeah, he was just trying to get some breakfast, man. I mean, I had the same adventure this morning. Oh. Mine involved a lot, of, a lot of breathing, a lot of running, a lot of jumping, a lot of crying. What? I went to Walmart. Okay guys, so binder update, we're almost done with the first booster box. I definitely want to finish the Fairly Odd Parents set, so we might pop into that other one. Here we go, this first page right here is already almost full. It's like very well spaced out. There is a lot of freaking great cars that are already connecting, but no complete full pages yet, but getting really close on a lot of them. All right, so that's where we're at. Gonna open up the rest of this booster box, and then from there, I decide if I'm gonna keep opening them into this box as well. I want to, but I also want the video to not be like, ridiculously long but at the same time I want to complete that set crank that soldier boy flip oh we got another tack character right there I don't even know what that thing is it just looks like um two-headed juju oh two-headed juju there we go and then next we've got oh that is an adventure gone wrong now that's yeah. what I'm talking about an adventure gone wrong he's got to get sent to the weenie hut jr <laughs> you know what? And the next card oh we got Sam Dullard and the next professor calamitous if you guys don't remember him he was the character that could not finish anything so we had like 50% projects everywhere in his office <laughs> next we've got Boom. Oh, yeah, that intro. is the best one. That is the one right there, dude. Doing the flip it. Oh, okay. Sandy is just doing the same sports everybody else is doing. <laughs> we got Sandy. Oh, is. that is what I've been waiting for, Rep Back. We have a Crimson Shin card. I literally, I'm not even joking. When we do the PSA submission, I might get <laughs> this card submitted. If there is a Crimson Shin motion card for sure, this card, I might get PSA. I would love to have a Crimson Shin PSA. PSA 10. And then, ooh, PSA 10 Tito. <laughs> All right, next. Oh, okay, we got the... This one's when he's lost in cyberspace. He's trying to catch Mr. Crocker's photo before it gets into the ether that is the internet. And then next we've yeah, right. got... Oh, oh my god! We have Chaos Mark Chang when he's just like Chaos! <laughs> Jimmy himself! There Jimmy himself! Is. I cannot believe we're this deep and there's just so many fresh cards. Jimmy, got it. Here's this one. One wears protective headgear when he goalies, and one wears protective headgear when he practices karate <laughs> with his squirrely pal. Both yellow. I'm saying Sponge and Sam. Let's see who it is. Three, two, one. Hey! <laughs> I mean, it's, it's pretty, yeah. <laughs> You're looking at the thickest character in all of animation. We're talking about the principal. <laughs> oh! All right. That is too much boob for YouTube. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Cut this stuff, man. We got Adventures Gone Wrong. Oh, right there. Get back. You owe me favors. And then, okay, what is the motion card? Oh, dude! It's the drawing version of them, too! Oh, that is sick! Alright, next reveal. Oh! Yeah. Okay, now I need two cards PSA. Know your boys gotta get the PSA Flying Dutchman as well. Need that, need that, need that. And the next one we've got, guess who? Who is SpongeBob's best friend? Jimmy Neutrons? Oh. Patrick. Sheen or Carl? I'm gonna go with Sheen. Sheen. Yeah. I'm gonna go with Sheen. Alright, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh, it's oh. Damn, Sheen. Let's see what the next car is. Oh, we got Reggie Reg. That's a new card. And then we got Timmy Turner for the first time nice. ever. And then what is the motion card? Crimson Chin would be amazing. <gasps> oh, okay. I'll still take that one. That's the one where Timmy gets hit with the ham. This is also in the intro card. Okay, so right off the bat, we got Vicky's dog. <laughs> the next, we got Sandy. Then, oh, oh, we got SpongeBob's Grandma Cookie. And the next, we've got Adventure Gone Wrong. I have no clue how that adventure went wrong. I have not, don't know. All right, then the last card, three, two, one. Oh, there it is. That is what I've been waiting for. That is, in my opinion, the most iconic one. And the one I relate to the most, I always wished in school that I could have a freaking, you know, fairly odd parents pencil and eraser. That would make school a hell lot more interesting. I, I wish I just had them in general. Just, you know. I wish I just had parents. <laughs>
Josh. Okay, doing the flip. Oh, we got Mark Chang when he caught Vicky right there. And then we've got Mr. Krabs. All right, all right. Cindy, there we need that is. too. Okay, looks like we have a sports card coming up. Ah! <laughs> Linebacker. Yes. All right, and the motion card. Oh, dude, nice. that's when freaking secret agent AJ came to block the pie. That was after he had, you know, realized that Timmy was a good friend. He's like, I'm going to save him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, I see something we need. <laughs> oh. Raymundo Rocket right there. That's what I was thinking they were talking about earlier. We got Raymundo. Vicky right there. Sweet. Guess who? Is that the one? These business owners sling the hash that keeps their towns going. Dude, that's oh, it. That's it. That's uh, that's Ray and Mr. Krabs for sure, right? Yeah. That I has to read be. the whole thing. The whole question, yeah. Boom, right Boom. there. That is the last guess who, guys. Right here, there is nine total guess who cards. There is a total of 10 guess who cards. I am trying to complete all of these different subcategories. And right there, the last one. Boom. Guess who? It's King Raptor. And he's tearing <laughs> through this set. All right. We got the big fat meanie. And then let's see the motion Why card. That's a misprint of stuff. I've seen one. Odd, right? Chase Mrs. Puff. And then we got... Boil! Oh, oh. Damn! We got the boil! That is so sick, dude. He gets closer and you can see his snotty noses. All those snotty nose kids. You see it? <laughs> you your phone. Each box contains a random assortment of 130 Nickelodeon cards. You are not guaranteed anything. There has not been one duplicate. The yeah, we, entire box. We've opened it all, right? There has not been one dupe in no dupe city. Yes! But now I feel like there is going to be many, many dupes. No, no, that's just, you know, that much bigger. No, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we can fill in these blanks that are left. You guys know how it is though. Nickelodeon always leaves me high and dry with one card missing. Hopefully that's not the case today. Let's find out. Okay, doing the first flip. This is a fresh box. So is it a duplicate? Yep. <laughs> one pack and all of a sudden it was Duke City. <laughs> We're gonna do this a little bit differently, Rep Pack, just because this video is already long. I can, I can, I can feel it. I can feel the time. So, what we are going to do is we are gonna go through the packs, but you guys are only gonna see the fresh new cards. There's only a couple left. Hopefully we can do it, Rep Pack. Let's do it. Please be a new freaking holo card. Hey, it's oh, new! Yeah. <laughs> we got Mark Chang when he did the gas, the poisonous gas, right there. Is it a new motion card? Oh! oh. <laughs> we got him lifting the rack, dude. You see that oh, movement? Yeah, he's freaking <laughs> lifting the world. Jorgen Mog Strangles. Let's add that one. There's like one card missing from every like section. All right, here we go. Next motion card. Three, two, one. Hey, oh, that's that's new. That's definitely think, new. Yeah, Either it's new or it's Tempur-Pedic. One of the two. <laughs> Dude, I'm telling you, they tried to give every like transformation of them. That is uh, that is perfect. That is what I want from a set. The first page is complete. Right back. Put this in there. Boom! One whole page. Now let's do it. Is it oh. moving? Oh yeah. <laughs> That is so freaking sick. Right there. So now we have a full page of motion cards. I cannot tell you guys how high quality these cards are. Honestly, probably one of my favorite sets that have ever been opened. I have to agree. It is amazing. I cannot wait to hopefully finish this. Still got some packs left. Let's keep doing it. What? Do we have the next one? Oh, oh, we don't have that. That's that down the toilet, right? That's the perfect one. You got him as the goldfish going down the toilet. That is sick. All right, flip it or rip it. Oh, rip it. Right. <laughs> got this one. We got this one. We got this. Oh, boy. Oh. We do not have that one. Oh, my God. <laughs> we have the start of the entire email episode. Okay, here we go. Let's inject that thing. And let's get the full page glisten. Oh, <laughs> nice. So now we've got the whole page moving. All right, so for the motion card, there is only two left to complete the entire Fairly Odd Parents motion card set rep pack. All right, and then we got three, two, one. Ah! <laughs> oh. Dude, we are getting super lucky. Oh my gosh, that's gotta be. This is 17 right here. Boom. Are you telling me there's only one more? There is one Fairly Odd Parents card left to complete the entire motion set. And there is, there's one, two, three, and four left. So there's five cards keeping this from a 100% complete Nickelodeon Tunes set. All right, so let one left. Is it the last one we need for the motion cards? Three, two, one. One. Hey! Oh! Let's go! Right there! We got it! So right there, we have 30, all 30 of the Fairly Odd Parents emotion cards have been 100% complete. And she's like, 
collection has grown. It will continue to grow if we find those last four cards. But let's see what that complete three pages looks like. Let's do it, Rep Pack. We have seen one complete page over here. We have seen another complete page here. And the three remaining motion cards here. One space left. That is it right there. Timmy getting hit with the volleyball. That is a perfect clip for the last one. Right there. Boom. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, go ahead. Give that deep turn. Yes. <laughs> so we have a complete motion collection right here, Rep Pack. Four cards left. Let's see what we can do. I told you guys, Nickelodeon is just a trope of leaving me with one on the board, but we'll try. We got Jorgen, and then... Oh! That's new! That's gotta be new! Okay, here we go. Right here. That's the spot. That is 103. Another complete page. So now, Ooh. there's one, two, three. The thing that's tough about this rep pack is there's three packs, three cards left. There's three packs left. There's no guarantee that I get them. And I am going to complete all of these sets, including the SpongeBob ones, all of them. It's just gonna take time because these were the only ones on the internet. It's hard to find this kind of stuff, but I promise you guys, we will finish everything no matter what. So subscribe if you're new here, but let's see what's in these last packs. All right, last two packs. Pull it, Mr. Crocker. Got it, got it, got it, got it. Damn it. One pack, dude. No, it's possible. It is possible. It's possible. It's possible. If you just get one step closer, I'll be happy. All right. Here we go, Rep Pack. All right, guys, so what we realized after opening a few packs, and you might notice as you go through the video, some of the packs were identical, literally the same exact card through the entire pack, but except for the last card would switch up. So when we got to this last pack, I literally didn't think there was any chance of anything. Neither of us thought there was a possibility of anything happening, but somehow what this did. What is it going to be? Three, two, one. Oh! Two cards left. Let's keep moving. Let's put this in there. See what the next card is. Oh! Oh my God! We only need one card. Oh my God! Okay, so SpongeBob, he's in there. He is in there. Okay, where is this girl go? We got Libby. I'm going to pass out. You see the packs. You see the empty boxes. There was two boxes here. And the set is complete. Oh my Started God. Started and finished. Started and finished. Let's put them in there, Rep Pack. This is what I like to see when we complete it. All right, so put that in there. It's your ass in there, Libby. I know what her name was too. Yeah. <laughs> and the last card. You know, my whole life was a Nickelodeon fan. I never, never thought there'd be this much weight on Twister. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. We are complete. <laughs> Let's go through a rep pack. Damn, that is sick. So the first page right here, got it. Complete. Second page, complete. We're just gonna go through it. You guys are seeing it all here. 100% complete. Feel free to pause it at any point if you guys want to see something in particular. That is all here. Anybody on the internet who has wanted to see a complete set of this, that's what it looks like right there. My book is closed, but the story has just begun. Let's get into the next one. <laughs> Free booster boxes. No, 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 we're done. It's weird. Most people that wander in trash, you know, they feel like they're missing something in life. For me, I'm 100% complete. All right, Rep Pack, that was an amazing ride, and I am sweating and drenched because I am a passionate man, and this <laughs> I am very happy about. I will cherish this always, and it was done, most importantly, with the Rep Pack. So thank you guys so much for being here. Check out the screen right here, which is actually the last epic card opening where I opened up the 2004 SpongeBob Top Set, which has a chase card in there that is a sketch card by Paul Tibbet. One out of like 10, I don't know. But they're very limited. Go check that out over there, guys. I'll see you guys over there. And as always, Rep Pack, we complete this set. Adios.